Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. As you can see I'm back, please excuse my hair and also the fact that my ears for some reason look pink and I also have stained neck from face paint so please excuse that if you are noticing those straight away about me. You can see the, the back end of my dog here. This is Wanda. You guys haven't met her yet because I have been MIA for three years. Covid hit and then I don't really know what happened to be honest. Uh, I'm gonna probably do an updated like Q&A or get to know me video again. I thought today I would show you some new um, lounge fly bags that I have acquired in the past week. So I have five new bags. If you do know what lounge fly bags are, and they are like these really cute backpacks and they do the Marvel themed, Disney themed, basically any pop culture themes. So there's like E.T., Back to the Future, there's like Elf, Grinch. Um, there's Coraline and they do Stranger Things. Why did I forget Stranger Things? Stranger Things is my favourite thing ever. What an idiot. I'm going to show you them. I was gifted two from Loungefly themselves which was so nice of them. I can't believe that because I have a series on my Instagram where I do like makeup inspired by the bags. So if you'd like to see them check my Instagram out. I will put it I'll put it up here. So the first bag that I'm going to show you, I'm going to do the three bags first that I brought on Saturday. Um, these are from a shop called Get Ready Comics. You can order them online or you can go to the shop. The shop is in Rochester. It's on the high street. It is so insane. Like there is not a centimeter of space that is not taken up by a comic, a pop, clothing, a lounge fly bag, pins, everything. They have everything. If you want to head there, go for it. Because I will definitely be going back. So I will show you the first three bags that I got. And then I also brought a hat and a pop. Yeah, let's show you. So the first bag that I picked up was this Beetlejuice bag. Can you cope? Can you cope? It is so pretty. So it's an all over print Beetlejuice. I love Beetlejuice and the fact that it's purple. Purple is my favorite color. I've been after a Beetlejuice bag and it was there. It was on sale. I had to have it. So I'm gonna show you it now. The bags as well, they also usually have like a print something inside so i'm going to show you now they also pack these bags with so much stuffing um so you're gonna have to bear with me to try and get the stuffing out and try and show you so inside it is just purple beetlejuice 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 with that inside it's so cute they're such a good size as well if you like me and you go to disney and universal like the parks and stuff these are perfect um for the rides and they also fit in like the lockers perfectly as well so yeah i am obsessed with this this will definitely be coming with me to universal in october because i am going back and i will be wearing this in the parks but yeah i love this bag so much it is stunning like even this as well The detail everything about it is so nice so this was 52.99 from get ready comics okay, let's go on to the next one so the next bag i got from get ready comics is this beautiful bag here this is my this is my third fourth fourth spider-man bag i also have gwen miles and then i have the universal it's like the comic blue and red one but this is the metallic spidey look i love the coloring of these lenses um this is like slightly sparkly i will show you the bag So it is stunning. I will show you the um, inside detail again. These bags are 
they're just they're perfect they are perfect they are my favorite thing ever i think that's why i've got <laughs> so many hello because i just put stuffing on the floors inside look at the print as well <laughs> if you know me you know i'm obsessed with spider-man spider-man is one of my favorite characters except for wanda hence why my dog is called wanda but yeah i am obsessed with this bag i love it so much this was also from get ready comics you can obviously order it or you can go to the store and this one is 69.99 so i can't wait to put this on a shelf with um my other spider-man ones they're gonna look so cute and i think this one might be coming with me to disney i have um like 23 bags now so i need to choose how many i take because i have my eye on ones that i want to buy out there but yeah this one's gorgeous so the next bag that i got from get ready comics is this bag here so this is a vision like cosplay bag it's part of the infinity saga collection this bag is extra special because this is a get ready comics exclusive um and also this the mind stone lights up which is so cool um i think this only came out potentially last week i think you can only get it so as soon as i saw it i was like that is coming home with me i need that bag because i have um two or three wanda backpacks and i needed vision i have a wanda vision one as well so i need a vision to go with them you know what i mean so i will show you what the bag looks like it is so pretty the colors i don't even think like on camera it does it justice I'm going to show you what it looks like with the light on and I will show you the inside print. So I've already taken the um, some of the stuffing out so you can see, but look. And this has a little it's secret like inside pocket as well, which is kind of cute. So it's just got that print inside and there's a little battery pack in the front there. And you just flick the switch. Are you ready? I'm going to turn the lights down just so you can see it a bit better so if i turn that off can you see <sighs> look how cool it is i am obsessed with this bag i really am i think this could be a new favorite and i do think every single one i'm showing you i'm saying oh i think this is coming with me which is a slight problem because i say that every time i get a new bag but this in the parks like at night put that lit up would be really cool but anyway, yeah, I love this. I also really love um, this here. Oh, it's so cute. Ah, I'm so happy with these bags. This bag was $74.99 as well. So I, I'm so happy with these bags from Get Ready Comics. Guys, you need to go. If you love lounge fly, if you love pop, if you love anything like that, go. It was so busy in there. There was constantly people coming in as well. One, what have you just knocked off? little troublemaker she is sorry if the camera has moved slightly the angle wand knocked the light off um and now she's scratching and being a naughty gal so i had to go and get treats right kiss kiss <laughs> go on then right go be a good girl you can't just stand here go be a good girl <laughs> what right. do you do right jump up here right sit sit right you can have a couple so yeah as i was saying um the next two bags are from loungefly themselves that they have gifted me they are not out so these two bags are part of the september collection um you can pre-order them now you can pre-order them from get ready comics funko europe truffle shuffle geek core any of those places um i always recommend get ready though because that's everywhere that i i get my bags from you know what i mean so the first bag that i got is the new corpse bride bag look how beautiful she is she is stunning um the moon is actually lenticular so the butterflies move they fly one stop making your lips in the background oh, so yeah this is the bag
it's stunning. As soon as I saw it, I was like, that needs to go in my collection. So this obviously has um, a front pocket and a second pocket. So let me take some stuffing out and I will show you what it looks like. So this is the print inside. So it just has Emily and Victor and like the same print. I love the, I love the you know, print inside. I think the print just adds the extra detail. But yeah, the actual bag is stunning. Look at it. Oh. I'm obsessed with this one. I love the plaque as well. So pretty. So I will be doing um, makeup looks with all these bags as well. I forgot to say that. So thank you so much, Lounge Boy. I just got to show you the clip. On the strap is this beautiful butterfly. Which, the butterfly or is it moth? I think it's a butterfly. So yeah, I got this one too. So the last bag that I have to show you guys is probably one of my favourites. I've already used it. So when I went to Get Ready Comics on Saturday, I wore it there because I love it. And if you love Stranger Things and Eddie Munson as much as myself, hence the friends don't lie jumper on today, um, yeah, you're probably gonna want this bag. <laughs> Look at it! Oh my god, it's so good. So yeah, this is the Stranger Things new September launch. The new Stranger Things bag for the September collection, let's just say that. Um, as you can tell, it's Eddie in the Upside Down, the Nova Blatz. He's playing Master of Puppets. He looks amazing. Look at this bag. And this is a little extra thing, is the um, lightning glows in the dark. Which is why I think I might be taking this one to Halloween Horror Nights with me. Um, it is full at the moment because I am in the process of using this as my handbag, but yeah, I thought I would show you it anyway. She is beautiful. The straps as well are so cool. There are so many looks I could do with this. I've obviously taken the stuffing out, but the print inside is just the Hellfire Club logo over and over again in black. I am fully obsessed with this bag. This is probably one of my favorites. Any Stranger Things bag instantly becomes a favorite because of my obsession with Stranger Things. All of these bags though are so beautiful. They are stunning. I love them. I love Loungefly. The obsession is um, strong with them. Yeah. And I'm so, so happy that um, Loungefly gifted me this. Loungefly, if you're watching, I doubt you are, but if you do, thank you so, so much. It means the world. Um, I will treasure these. These are my babies now. I love them with my whole heart. Um, I will be wearing them everywhere. And I definitely think this will be coming with me to Halloween Horror Nights. I also have the the red and blue, um, like the characters on the top, faking it upside down one. And I might pop it here if you want to see. Um, but I did a look inspired by that bag and I loved it. And I think other people really like that one. So it's between both of those bags of which one I take for Halloween Horror Nights for the Stranger Things house. I don't know. I wish I could take both. Maybe I can take both and get my mum to wear one because that would be a cool photo. Anyway, I <laughs> just keep going on about it. So, that is the um, five new bags I have acquired this week. Um, just the last two items that I got. These other two items I got when I went to Get Ready Comics. This is the Scarlet Witch Pop. This is from the Doctor Strange and the Multiverse of Madness. Um, I love Wanda. Wanda is my, one of my favourite Marvel characters. Probably is my favourite Marvel character because she literally is the most powerful queen ever and I love her. So I had to get the pop. This is my first pop. I know. Some people are like, don't get started because then you'll get sucked in, which is the same of what happened with Roundfly. I know, but I needed Wanda because, like I said, I have several bags and I wanted to be able to put a pop with the bags. I'm planning on getting the Wednesday pop next probably because I loved 
Wednesday. I just love the Adams family. Um, there is a Wednesday lounge fly coming soon as well. Keep your eyes peeled for that because it looks so good. And I'm also thinking of getting Eddie. Maybe a couple of Stranger Things ones. If I can find the Vampire Diaries ones, I will be getting those as well. So the last purchase that I got was this Hellfire Club hat, which, perfection. I love this on the side. I love the font, I love the fire. So, so good, just plain black. Um, this will be coming with me to Universal. I will be wearing this in the parks. If you spot me wearing it, come say hi, I'm joking. <laughs> I said that like I was famous. She's not. Um, yeah. So this bat, this hat will be going with one of the Stranger Things bags. I just need to make up my mind on which one. That was my haul, guys, of my five new bags. My mum picked up a bag and a purse. She got like um, the Harry Potter. I can show you. It's right here. My mum grabbed this um, lounge fly. Look at that, that's sick. Look at the way it changes, it's so cool. Um, but yeah, my mum picked that up and then she also got one of the OG Deadpool purses. My brother picked up Spider-Man black suit Venom bag. He's been after that one for a while, so he picked that up as well. Loungefly is a big love in our house. We have Loungefly all here. There's some over there, there's two up there. Um, yeah. There's lunch fry everywhere. I might actually show you one more that my mum will want. I'll, I'll grab it. This isn't mine, this is my mum's. But this is the Madame Leota. It's a Disney Parks exclusive bag. She is beautiful, she is gorgeous. She is my mum's because my mum loves Haunted Mansion. So she got the Disney Parks exclusive and she is stunning. But yeah, I wish I could tell you the prices of these bags. They usually retail for around 75 pounds to like 85 i would say that's like the normal price some do come out cheaper though because the one of the wonder ones i got was like 65 or something when it first came out um and obviously over time if people resell them in different places they drop sometimes they're on sale for like 40 quid which is why i freak out and then i just add them to my basket and buy them so yeah, there are so many. I will put the um, the links to Get Ready Comics, Funko Europe, Loungefly, their Instagram and their websites down below so you can have a look for yourself. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I am planning on doing lots more videos soon. So please let me know if there's anything specifically you'd like to see. Obviously, I haven't spoken to you guys about my life and what's going on in three years it's been a very long time i think my last video was like a, a trailer reaction so please let me know if there's anything you would specifically like to see whether it's makeup tutorials makeup reviews vlogs because i love vlogging i am planning on doing some vlogs when i'm on holiday so when i go to disney universal just orlando probably the flying there i'll vlog it all um, on my camera I'm thinking of doing separate videos for Mickey's Not So Scary and Halloween Horror Nights. So let me know if you would really like to see those. I'll probably just do them anyway. If you guys are like, I don't want to see it. <laughs> I'm doing it anyway because I want to do it. I want it for myself. I want to be able to rewatch them. If you'd like, if you want me to do a QA and a video, like what's going on in my life, what's going on in general, because it's been a while. Yeah, let me know. Um, I'm also planning on doing like some tutorials on some of my Halloween looks and stuff. I've already started some of my Halloween makeup looks, um, which I'm very excited to show you guys on my Instagram, so go follow me there if you would like to see when it comes to October and see other makeup that I do. Um, thank you so so much for watching, I love you guys, I have missed you all so so much, um, but yeah please comment, like, subscribe, let me know any thoughts, let me know if you liked this video, if you were bored. Maybe don't, because that would just hurt my feelings. I'd never want to be boring. Um, but yeah, I love you guys lots, and I will see you in the next video. Bye. Show me. That was the dog. Not anymore. Why don't you go to comps? My dog is interrupting me. That's so rude. Right, jump up. Not up there. Kiss. Right, high five. Oh, you good girl. Just a while. Right, kiss. Um, what? Ah. Did I say you can have it?
Alright, jump up again. <laughs> kiss. Kiss. How about fist bump? Yeah, you good girl. You're so smart. One. Uh. Say hi, I'm so beautiful. <laughs> <laughs>